Well, good morning, South Florida. I'm Andrew Perez. Here's a look at stories making news on this Saturday morning. A 13 year old is in custody, accused of stabbing his own mother to death in her sleep with his newborn baby sister nearby. Cell phone video showed Derek Rosa walking out of their Amelia Oaks apartment off West 79th place while officers waited outside to arrest him. They say he called 911 after the alleged murder and confessed to killing his 39 year old mother, Irina Garcia. His 14 day old sister was unharmed. Rosa's stepfather was out of town at the time. Hundreds of demonstrators came to a pro Palestinian rally at Bayfront Park Friday. The protesters were there to denounce the killing of Palestinians in Gaza as Israeli forces respond to the attack carried out by Hamas militants a week ago. Tensions rose and police were forced to step in at times, taking some people into custody here. But protesters and counter protesters both agreed no more civilians should die. The defense team in the murder retrial of South Florida rapper YMW Melly have motioned to dismiss the case due to misconduct. This comes two days after lead prosecutor Christine Bradley was removed from this case. The defense says they learned of alleged wrongdoing from the lead detective and Bradley failed to properly notify them. The judge says the state attorney's office has until Tuesday to assign a new lead prosecutor. He also added that he will rule on the defense's motion to dismiss at a later date. Well, Taylor Swift's Eras Tour concert film had a big turnout in numerous movie theaters across the country, including right here in South Florida. The Swifties came out in droves to see the highly anticipated film. Moviegoers traded friendship bracelets and sang some of the biggest hits to celebrate. The film has already broken some major records to $100 million in pre-sale tickets. Uh, Taylor Swift is bringing her Eras Tour to Hard Rock Stadium next year as well. Remember, as breaking news happens, we've got you covered on air and online. You can head to our website, local10.com for more.